Uh, my name is Liz Mock, and I've been a Marion Olay Missioner since 1976, so it's about 43 years now. Uh, right now, we're at a place called Jipe Moyo in Musoma, Tanzania, uh, which is part of the Diocese of Musoma. I've been working with the Diocese since uh, 2011, so about eight years now, uh, doing working for the Bishop in the Office of Planning and Development. And what we do is we administer all of the health, education, and social services of the diocese. And Jipe Moyo is one of these uh, places, these social services. So I, it's really where my heart is, so I tend to spend a lot of time here. Jipe Moyo was founded uh, as a, a shelter for children originally, and then it's moved into being a specialized shelter for children who are running from all forms of gender-based violence. So that could be child marriages, which we have here in Tanzania, uh, female genital mutilation, uh, that's the majority of our young women, uh, domestic abuse, sexual abuse, trafficking, and most of the young boys that are here, there's about maybe 10, are all from the streets almost. Female genital mutilation is against the law here in Tanzania. And it, they try to enforce it, but it's very difficult because it's part of the socializing of a young woman who can then get married. And so many of the ethnic groups that are still doing it want to do this so that their girls can be married off. So we're dealing with something so deep in a culture that it's hard to make a change. Uh, in Tanzania, about 15% of the girls undergo FGM, but here in Mara region where we are, 44% of the girls undergo this. So it's education of the police, the social workers, the government people, the teachers, the parents. Education of young women today is absolutely the most essential thing that can be done to make any change in the world today. So our goal here is to get them into high school or into you know primary school and then high school and get through that because then they're going to be more educated to make their own choices in the future. One of the things that we've just instituted is we've uh, built a school for young women. We hope to get to be about 50 young women. And each year they will come and they will do a year of tutorial. If the girls are out in these villages way out, they're not getting a good primary education. And because of that, they can never go on to secondary school. So our goal is to go in, get 50 girls a year, do a year of tutorial and see if we can get them into uh, secondary schools and keep moving them forwards. Courage is probably one of the things that I admire most in all of these girls. I, I see eight-year-olds, I see ten-year-olds that are standing up and saying we're not undergoing FGM, we're running from child marriage, whatever it is, and they're learning about their rights and they're stopping it. So I think the change is going to come because of them. I really love being in Tanzania. I love being here with the people and being part of uh, this life and, and everything that they share with me and I share with them. There's, there's always new challenges and new places to work and go deeper in with the women and try to work in the best we can for the women to make change.